Hello everybody. Hello folks. Hello Robbie. Indiana Jason. Test, test, test. Get that right up. Get that right up. Hello folks, hello. Pat that. Husey. Hey, my boy. Andrew. James Sargent. Lanky. Tip for the barber. Aye, aye, yep. Um, Mumbled Fox. S. Parolo. Hello, Anna is right. Not a subscriber, but that's fine. Um, come on in, everybody, and we'll talk about it. Hello, eh, Corn King. Um, whose generosity will go down in history? His generosity is never. Yo, Corn King, you need never get another penny in your life. Thank you. Hello, uh, Secret Sciences. Uh, Cronsdale Crush. Hello, everybody. Come on in. This is a new game. It's not a, it's not a new game to the market. It's a new game to me. And I have been recommended. Um, been recommended that I get this. Hello, everybody. I, I noticed me, says L91. I noticed you. Hello there. Bojack says, the fuck is this? This is a, this is a, a puzzle game. This is, this is a mystery um, detective game. This is, do you have a wee practice before streaming? No, I just wanted to see if my webcam was in the right position and I think this is the best, best position. It's absolute shite, but 10 out of 10 rating. Well, Jason, we'll see all about it. We'll see all about that then, wouldn't we? Nice helling, thank you very much. Greg Harris. Thank you. Greg Harris, thank you very much for the sub. First time subscriber. It's mum's new boyfriend. Thank you. It's mum's new boyfriend is proud to be in the two month club. Returning for the second month. Thank you very much for resubscribing. Jag Colley, thank you for resubscribing for your second month. Thank you very much, and I see the wee heart symbol you did. Well then, I think we're ready to play this game. Thank you. El Scorcho, thank you very much for uh, subscribing for the first time. Thank you very much. Um. Well, everybody, hold on. AV options. Let's check this out. Sorry. I keep that on. Keep it Thank you. Ravioli Publicity. Fantastic name. Thank you very much for the sub. First time subscriber. Thank you. Just a pigeon. Thank you very much for resubscribing. Coming back for a second month. Fish dud, fish dud. Thank you very much for subscribing for the very first time. Subtitles if possible. Oh aye, of course, of course. Um. There we go. There we are. There we are. Lemme nose hair. What? Hmm? 
Nee, nu zei hulle, trim dat het. Trim dat al. Wat trim dat al? Toen kie me, toen kie me. Wat trim dat nu zei hulle? Ok, nee, nu zei hulle. Trim dat al. Is fijn. Je trim je nu zei hulle, dat is rijk. Kom ze trim me fucking nu zei hulle. Ik fucking vroeg, jij gaan, ten. Right. Right, troops. I think it's enough years. You see. You see. Um. I just want to wait just a wee second though. This isn't the sort of game I don't think that people can. People can step into like 10 minutes for now. I think we've got to watch this. Troops. Are you ready to rock and roll here? He's ready to rock and roll. Where are your eyebrows? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe this game. Maybe this game is to find out where my eyebrows are. I don't know. Thank you. Kenroy McCrimer. Thank you very much for subscribing. First time subscriber. Thank you. Todd Ferguson MBE. Thank you very much for the donation, mate. Uh, this is for Maggie. Thank you very much. Thank you. Def, def aid or def for the def aid. Thank you very much for return. I've uh, been a, a two month subscriber. Thank you very, very much, mate. I need some moisture on you or something. Every time I do that, it's got these big fucking red lines. Jesus Christ. Thank Trips you. are going to get started. Mr. Banana Man 49, thank you very much for this uh for subscribing for the very first time. Thank you very much. Thank you. Ziak or Zeke 24, thank you very much for the tier one sub money out your end pocket. No Twitch Prime account, which is good. But thank you very much. And finally a surveillance camera. Thank you very much for subscribing. Thank you very much. Are you ready to begin? Thank you. Daniel Eager, thank you very much for returning for the second month. Thank you for the subscription. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Vexer, wowee. Vexer, wowee. Has you have returned for the second month. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. Right, let's fucking go. Thank you very, very much. Let's fucking go, troops. Now let's watch the intro here. You have come and subscribed and you're here. Not to watch me talking about fucking subs or donations, but to watch the content. Let us begin. I have already watched this intro. Wait till you fucking see this shit. Thank you. Frank, thank you very much for uh, resubscribing for your second month. Here we go. My name is Jenks, Detective Inspector Frederick Jenks. Look at the state of this cunt. To a last minute investigation into the death of Kate Vine, a PhD student found drowned at midnight last Friday in a lake in the woods on the outskirts of the tiny village of Edenton. Look at I this. Until first thing tomorrow morning to decide whether her death was a simple accident or whether this was murder. Kate Vine appeared to the world to be a bright, confident, fun-loving PhD student with everything to live for. However, a history of depression and alcoholism revealed in her medical records suggests that in reality she had become adept at hiding behind a mask. A lab report indicating a high level of alcohol in her blood, along with the late hour of her death and a lack of witnesses, makes a strong case that this was suicide. But the verdict overlooked some curious details. Why was her driving license found on the opposite side of the lake in which she drowned? Also, 40, yeah. there were traces of morphine in Kate's system. Where did she get it? 
Tragedy. This isn't the first time that Atlas has been investigated. Atlas and their questionable methods, which many have suggested border on mind control. Ryan is married to Rebecca, landlady of Edenton's village pub, the George and Dragon. As yet, she hasn't been interviewed, though it's likely Kate visited the pub on more than one occasion. Pip. One of Kate's friends was Emma Bowman, who lives at Eden Lodge on the road leading out of Edenton Village. Thank you. Emma was also doing a PhD at the same university, PhD. but didn't attend Atlas. Interviewed after Kate's death, Emma seemed shocked and upset, insisting she hadn't seen Kate that night. However, it turned out her boyfriend had. Simon Thompson met Emma at university. <laughs> after completing his degree around 18 months ago, Jeff, he done, he a shop in the neighboring village. He started at the Atlas course a few months ago. Simon insisted that he didn't see Kate after the meeting, but the sergeant interviewing him noted he seemed oddly unmoved by her death, which makes him the first person I want to see tonight. State, it's yeah. time for some answers. State your fucking hat. Right, so there's your intro. Right, so good luck in fucking remembering that. Um, Mr. Bezhead, looking forward to seeing you in Birmingham. Thank you very much for the five pound fucking donation, mate. Do not approach me on the night asking for that money back. That money is now mine. Thank you very much, and I'll see you there. Right. So um. So here we go. Here we go. So, how much? How much of that did you fucking remember? How much of that did you remember? Thank you. The beef man, thank you very much for donating two pounds. Any chance of a Twitch version of the twenty-four hour limit one k? Lose some vermin. No chance, mate. Thank you. That's my career, mate. Absolutely no chance, mate. That's my fucking career. Uh, Layla Wolf, thank you very much for subscribing. First time subscriber. Right. Thank you. Very good name there. Marina's Apartment Complex, thank you very much for subscribing. That's a fantastic name. Right. So here's what we know. There's some lassie who drowned, it looked like suicide. Um, a driving licence was found at the other side of the, the pond. She had morphine in her system. She had, she's a PhD student with everything to live for. Um, 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 and everybody's a suspect. Thank you. Diabetic wee boo. Diabetic wee a boo. Thank you very much for subscribing. Right, here we go. It looks like some sort of cult sort of thing or something. Here we, here we go then. Um, res resume game, right. Oh look, um, I came on previously just to get this thing set up, just to make sure my my thing was in the right um, position. So I'm going to do reset game, right? Thank you. Right. Um, John Bremner, just one more day. Thank you very much for resubscribing for the second month, mate. Welcome to Edenton Village. Click the arrows to move around the village. If you see the magnifying glass, try your investigative button to see Jenks. 
investigate. Fucking jenks. Right, there he is. Go left down West Street. Go ahead to the pub. Go right up North Lane. The village centre. Friday after 5pm. Um, right, here we go. Let's check it out. Click the inventory or inventory icon. Thank you. Enthusiastic.co, thank you very much for the sub. Click the inventory icon to see your collected items, which includes both physical objects and, and information. Jinx has collected. If you're at a location where you think you can use a physical item, try the use icon. Kate Vine in brackets, she died. And there's a picture. Kate Vine death. Kate's license. Right, here we go, trips. Right. Right, here we go. Um, What's this? Kate's driving license. Kate's driving license was found on the bank of the lake near Kate's body with a piece of tape attached. Click to try using this. Alright. There's no use for Kate's lost driving license here, sorry. Thank you. Ricky Tails, thank you very much for subscribing. First time subscriber. Thank you. Kate Vine's death. This she is. Kate Vine's body was found in the woods in the, uh, lake early last Saturday morning. Right. Uh, there you go, there's some facts. Here's a, here, a look. Um, click a pin to move to that location. I'm here, I think. Body found here. All right, there's that Atlas place there, right? Um, but this show tips. <laughs> Home, main menu. Toggle between mouse, control, and keyboard. Right, right, right. Right, troops, let's go. Let's investigate. Go ahead to the pub. There we go. Check this fucking shit out. What? What happened? Go. Alright, Nick can't see her. Right, let's go down this way then. Let's go down this way. Um, Let's check. Well, where the fuck am I? Post office. Pull I don't know. Let's, let's, let's just play it by ear. Play it by ear. Right? Play it by ear, man. Play it by ear. Um, right, get rid of that. Keep going, man. Keep going. Go left in West Street. Call the, call the chief. No, keep, keep going, man. All the way. Right, get fucking down there, man. Get down there and have a wank. Oh, come on. Um, right. Back up. Back up. Right, call the chief. Now, why would I do that? Um, go down behind Brandon House. Head right to the centre of Rebecca's pub. Go right up the lane. Fucking look at his fucking Tory bastards, look. These Tory bastards. Continue ahead along the path. Go back to the village centre. Go right along Woods Lane. Let me have a, let me just have a wee look about, right? Edenton, Edenton Village Hall. Go back to Junction. Right, 
Uh, that's where I was. That's where I was. Go back. Go this way. Go this way. Go left to the woods. Go to the jetty. Oh look, check your fucking shoes, man. Oh look. Looks like a piece of jewellery there. Stuck between the boards. Well and truly wedged in. Right. Let, let me see that. I, I, I need to see that. Look at this state of aim, man. Let's go back. Look at this state of aim. Go back. Oh my god. Look at the fucking state of aim, man. Thank you. This guy's a state. Nicky Jink. Are you the Jinx? Uh, thank you very much for subscribing, gents. Welcome to your investigation. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, what was that? Isn't that there? Thanks. Is that? that there? Uh, Mr. Grift, thank you very much for subscribing. Right, troops, let's get this game completed as quickly as possible. Right? Those are pointing to the next clue. It's got fucking hard on these shoes. Uh, go left to the woods entrance. Um, that's the way I came. Continue the path ahead. Saria Slays, thank you very much. 500 bits, thank you very much. Main question investigate. What's the thing? Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Her hang uh, was morphine and being a thing on a PhD. Alexa also 91, thank you very much for the first time subscription. Let's get on with the game. Let's just try and get this fucking completed. Right. Let me go back. There we go. Further in the woods. Let's go to Atlas. Let's go. Enter the Atlas building. Have to come back later, I think. That's the uh, chain. Yeah, I'll come back later then. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. I've got to remember that I'm actually turning back the way. And then just go to the clearing. That looks good. Good stuff. Um, sorry, I went the wrong way, that. Uh, take a left. Straight ahead. Um, what's this? Go here. There's fucking shoes in this cunt. Oh, look, look. Knock for Simon, here we go. I said, oh, no, 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 there was a clue. No, oh, here we go. Shh, 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 shh. Is it Simon? Uh, yeah. Detective Inspector Jenks, I'm investigating an incident in the village. Could I come in and ask you a few questions, please? Um, yeah. Thank you. Uh, we can just go through here if you want. Uh, Emma's working in the front room. Hi. Uh, this is Inspector Jenks. Jenks. What's all this about? There was a death in the village. Kate Vine, I believe you both knew her. Yeah. Do you need to speak to both of us? Uh, I'll just speak to Simon first, if that's okay. Just come through. Is it okay in here? Oh, this will be fine, yeah. Do you want anything? Water? No, 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 I won't be long. Okay. Hi, 
need Detective Inspector Jinx here. Can I, can I come in? Okay. Hi, Detective Inspector Jinx here. I'm investigating the death. Can I come in? Is he... Is, is Jinx actually meant to be the, a police? Is it meant to be a, an actual fucking policeman? A detective? Wearing a fucking hat? Right. I need to see that again. Right, uh, uh, right. Kate Vine's death. Kate Vine's body was found in the woods early. Uh, woods Lake early last Saturday morning. Your first interview. First. Pick an item you want to ask about, then click ask to see Jinx ask about it. When you've heard the reply, you'll see a summary of what was said in the box at the bottom. Simon said blah blah blah, he also said yeah yeah yeah. Right, okay. Clicking any item you've already asked about shows the summary of replies beneath. Now click any reply to add it to the contradiction box on the right. You can add two replies at a time. This reminds me a wee bit of what um um uh, papers please it reminds me a wee bit of papers please right now you can start looking for contradictions find two contradictory replies and add them to the contradiction box if they go green sit back and watch Jenks interrogate your interviewee yes. Jenks hasn't asked Simon about this yet. Select to ask what he knows. Okay. When was the last time you saw Kate Vine? Um, so last Friday's meeting, I think. Did you see her after the meeting? No. How long have you known Kate? That would be when we started Atlas. Three months ago. Did you socialise outside Atlas? No. How would you describe her? Like, what sort of person was she? Fun loving. Well, Great. she's talented. Uh, full life. Mm -hmm. Full of life, you know? Sharp, quite sharp. Mm -hmm. Would you say she had any emotional problems? She, her mood, her mood could change. And, well, there was the drinking problem. Mm. Did you become aware of that? Well, she would come mm. drunk to a meeting sometimes. Mm. She would reek of the stuff. I mean, everyone knew, but nobody really said it. Mm. So, cool. tell me a bit about Atlas. Oh, it was just a business management training program for postgrads. Mm. And you started this after you left college? Uh, yeah. And it's on every Friday? Yeah, well, my group isn't doing it this Friday, but uh, one of the groups is. Okay, mm. thanks. Thank you. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. This, here we go. Hmm. This is good stuff. Last saw Kate at the Atlas meeting last Friday. All I know in Kate for three months. Didn't socialise with Kate outside Atlas. Kate often seemed drunk at Atlas. Okay. What about this? Have you over? Ah. What you got to say about the driving license? Hmm. This. Did you know whether Kate had lost this? Uh, lost the license? No. No, I don't think so. <laughs> He's lying. <laughs> He's lying because the actor, the actor portrayed, I don't know if you saw that there, but the actor portrayed, portrayed some sort of, I doubt, some sort of suspicious, I, I, the, the actor used his skills to portray something no quite right there. I don't know if you, I don't know if you saw it there, but you like that. I don't know that she she didn't have a driving driver license. Um, 
No da tener un nodo, ¿eh? Very, very good. This game when it work was the actors are able to portray that emotion using their skills that they've learned in acting school. I'm very happy with this game. Let's continue. Right. Well. All right. All right. No contradictions here. Let's visit Emma, and let's see. She knows. Thank you. Probably be back later. Don't worry. It's only a few questions. There was no reveal by that voice. Yeah. That voice there. Okay, Emma. Uh, just a few questions. <clears throat> when was the last time you saw Kate Vine? It was last Thursday in the college library. Um, I saw her and we chatted for a bit. Just the question. Just usual self. What? what was the usual self? And what was that then? Oh, just Kate being Kate. You know, a bit wild. Wild? Wild? What way wild? Oh, I am. Oh, she just used to question everything, you know. Uh, uh, arguments with the lecturers, things like that. <laughs> what else? And else, come on. Kate had a drink problem. What else? How uh, noticeable was that? Well, it come on, man. But. As the year went on, she'd be drunk in the afternoon. No. But I think she cut down. You what know, do you mean by my old man? When she started her PhD. What do you mean by my old man? Come on, what do you mean now? <laughs> oh, oh, wilds. And what about yourself? Come on, we all like a wee drink now and then. Come on, we all like a wee drink now and then, don't you? I know I do. <laughs> tell me about tell me about you. Tell me something that will impress me. Tell me something that's will that will impress me. Tell me tell me something that will that will impress me. I'm a police officer. Last saw Kate in the college library on Thursday. Kate appeared her usual self. Kate was argumentative at college. Thank you. Oak Hart says, rake these Tory cunts over the coals, jinks. Aye. The twist will be, thank you very much for the donation there. The twist will be that jinks is a Tory. There are fucking Tories down there anyway, man. Kate was argumentative at college. Kate had a drink problem at college. Kate didn't. It, she didn't see Kate very often. Okay, so far so good. No contradictions. No contradictions. Hmm. This is where I'm going to catch her out. Hold on. Thank you. Alan Partridge, thank you very much for the tier one sub. Thank you very much. I don't know why you were banned before. Thank you. Jose Mumford, thank you very much for the, 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 the tier two, um, tier one returning for the second month. Jenks did it and he's doing this to cover up, of course. Of course. Of course, hold on, this bastard and computer. It's the hard drive. It's the hard drive. It's the fucking hard drive, man. It's the hard drive. Right, let's get into it. Thank you. D for Dan. D for Dan. D for Dan. Thank you very much for resubscribing for your second month. Get a SSD. First of all, it's an SSD. Right, if you're going to put it that way. And I have got an SSD, but it's the hard drive, the storage drive, the bigger, the bigger one. Um, I think it's, I'll, I'll work out, I'll work out what the problem is. 
fuck me, he scalped you. I know, I know. I know. Um, I know. I know. The 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 sound is they coming for the 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 sound is they coming for the hard drive itself. It's it's touching something, and the vibration is causing this this sound. Like see if I hold down on the case there or there or there, it stops. See if I unscrew the side of the case to try and figure out what the problem is, the vibrating stops. Jammy Dodger says tighten the screws. I tightened them like fuck. That's actually what was causing the fucking problem. Is when I loosened them a bit. Just the the, the, the glass panel at the side. It's making less sound. Get soundproofing. You don't know right. Uh, Chonks TV. Thank you very much. When uh, will we ever get Twitch plays Adventure Quest? I, I'm 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 unfamiliar with Adventure Quest. Thank you very much for the donation, but I'm unfamiliar with anything called Adventure Quest. Did you know whether Kate had lost this or not? Um, I don't know, but I, I don't think so. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Don't worry about it. You're off the for now. Eh, uh, it Simon? That's all for the moment. Thank you. Okay. Um. Uh, no, I think I think we're. Uh, I think I don't see that. I don't see any. Uh, don't see any contradiction here. Shinzi, thank you very much for the 1500 bits. Take all the cables out. It's fine. It's not. No, it just. It just maybe needs something needs to be tightened in the kind of case that holds the hard drive. That's it. That's it. So I back later on if that's okay. Best to knock on the window for Emma. Simon always answers the front door. What? All right. Right. Um. It's not the fan. It's not the fan that's making the sound. I opened up the side, I have touched the fan, while hearing the vibrating sound, I have to have the case shut. I sort of put a wee bit of paper in to stop the fan. It's not the fans, it is definitely the hard drive. Definitely. Because the, the vibrating sound stopped. And see when I went to Explorer and then clicked on D, you know sometimes hard drives go into kind of sleep mode. When I, cl I clicked on D, I couldn't get into the D drive for a few moments, you know, till it kind of starts up. The vibrating started again. Pretty sure it's that, so I just need to tighten a wee thing up. And so I, I chatted away to the guy for scan the day online, chatted away him, and he said, uh, Do you think you'd be confident enough? Do you think you'd be able to open up yourself? I went, Aye, aye, no bother. Thank you. Be better off if you, if you say, uh, instead of sending us out a duff fucking motherboard or whatever it was, was rang with the first one and you have that fucking <laughs> it'd be good if you got it right first time Dilbo Dobbins thank you very much for resubscribing for the second month and Stranti thank you very much for subscribing for the first time both of you thank you very much Right, let's go through this. Let's just get in it. Come on. What's going to happen here? A few more questions, if you don't mind. No, no, no. Get okay, here. that's it for now. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Right. You can down turn down fan and BIOS. It is not the fucking fan ice cream. I know you're a subscriber. Greatest of respects for subscribing. I need I appreciate every subscription. But it is not the fuck. Fucking fan, I'm just after telling you it is near the fucking fan. So why are you telling me? Do you know you can turn down the fan? It is near the fan. Vermin attitude says Bobo. It is. It's. It's like. It's an attitude becoming of. Um. Oh wait. 
Very trusting, leaving a bike unlocked. Looks like homebrew equipment. Oh. Ah, this might come in handy. It will. It will. Wait, wait a minute, you're not allowed to do that, that kid. He's not allowed to do that. He's not allowed to do that. He's not allowed to do that. And when he, and when he picked it up, he went like that, look, he picked up Milat. Was that there? A box of bottles. A box of bottles was seen outside Eden Lodge. Right, that's it. That's it. That's it. I've got them. That's it. A uh, few more questions, if you don't mind. I, you. Right, you. What's with us then? What is the bike outside? Oh, that's my cousin's. He lent me it. Uh, I need to buy a new lock Thank for you. it. Thank So it's your bike at the moment. Yeah, yeah. And there's no bus service to speak of around here, so it's really the only way to get around. He looks at Roger Walls. Mr. Falconer, thank you very much. Lenny, when the people of Glasgow will wait for you... ...like the world did for the People's Princess, thank you very, very much. Did you mean to ask when will the people? I don't. I don't know if you're. I don't know if it's a death threat. Maybe you better be. Bike belongs to Simon's cousin. Bike's all right. 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 Screwdriver. It isn't worth asking Simon about the screwdriver. Aye, right, tell us about this dickhead. I noticed a lot of bottles outside. Yeah, yeah, I'm at homeroom. For yourself? Well, no, I give it out to my friends and stuff. I tried selling it at first, but I didn't have any takers. Except for James over at Farmhouse. I, I used to trade it to him for, for herbs and stuff. Hmm. Do you see James a lot? No, not really. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. Gibbs HD, thank you very much, mate. You're watching Adventure Call. My name is Falcon, and I will be your guide on your quest. Thank you very much. You should have tuned in last night. Thank you. Just Probably be back later. This is fucking terrible. Ass cracking. We ass. I. Well, let's just see. Let's just see. Don't be negative. Whose is the bike outside? Oh, it's Simon's cousin's. He uses it to get to work. Hmm. You know, the lock's broken. Oh, I know. I keep telling him to fix it. Hmm. Okay. All right. Okay. Have you ever tried Simon's homebrew? Me? <laughs> no. I don't like beer. I only drink wine. I can't stand spirits either. Only drinks wine. Hmm. Okay, I'm just going to quickly. Uh, uh, Thank you. Probably be back later. Just going to speak to him once again. Um, okay. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to. I'm going to leave you guys That's for now. All for the moment. Thank you. I'm going to leave you guys for now. Okay. Oh, but I may be back. I might be back. Okay. Chapman on the window like that. Hi. Like that. Looking through the window like that. Oh, I, just, I just want to ask you a few questions. The window at the back. The window at the fucking back like that. I just want to ask you a few questions. This dodgy, dodgy, dodgy game. Dodgy, dodgy game, man. 
doors you. Uh, right, listen, here's what I'm going to quickly do. Watch this. Go here. Uh, go left into the woods. And then go to the jetty. And then... And then... Uh, screwdriver. Remember the thing that was in the green? There we fucking go. There we are. Interesting. I thought forensics had checked the whole area. Obviously not very Thank well. You. Shut up. They're a better job than you. Walking about with your fucking heart. Unprofessional. Utterly unprofessional. This is the best game yet, says Ice Cream 86. It is, isn't it? A broken pendant or pendant was retrieved near the lake in the woods. Okay, I'm just going to... Hold on, can I just go like that then? And then go... Bang. Bang. A couple more questions, if that's okay. Thank you very much, Spooky Poltergeist. Hi there, Brian. I want for a PC repair shop in the bars. If your computer's making a weird noise, it's most likely your fan. Checking that should be your first protocol. Can I just say, eh, Spooky Poltergeist, um, thank you very much for the 500 bits, mate. Thank you very much. It is not the fucking fan. It isn't the fucking fan. I have checked. I opened up the side of the, the side of the case. The buzzing sound stopped. But when I leaned the side of the case up against the, the main case, there's a faint, faint, faint buzzing. It's as if the buzzing comes from the glass side of the case being vibrated by something within the computer. So what I did was, there's a fan at the back, I touched that so it stopped turning. Buzzing still happened. The fan on the processor kept happening. The fan at the, fan at the front of the case, it kept happening. I'm just, as I just explained just a wee minute ago, it was the fucking, it is the fucking hard drive, the D drive, the storage one, the HDD, you know the SSD, the HDD, that one. Let me just play the game, right. Are you sure though? I mean, it's usually fine, right? Aye, right, okay. Okay. Okay, mate. Right, I just, right, I'm going to ask her about the, the pondo. Ever seen this? <laughs> nah. Looks like, uh, that's my old necklace. I gave this to Kate. So Kate might have been wearing it last Friday. Yeah, well, perhaps, but I can't see why. She was always buying new things, you know, lots of jewellery, stuff like that. It's meant Thank to be you. a bird in cage, but the cage's fallen off. Oh, I'll show you. I show you. Did you buy it? I didn't. Some wanted present. I show you. Myra. Mm, that's a secret. I see. That's how it should have looked. It's called a freedom necklace. Do you mind if I keep this? No, not at all. So the necklace did belong to Kate. Interesting. I'm starting to wish I'd brought a spare evidence bag. Thank you. Gibbs HD, thank you very much for the donation. And he says, have you tried checking the fan? Thank you very much for your help. Man and Myra says, sounds like someone is in denial over the fan. Thank you very much for the donation. Thanks for your help and input. Alex James, what him for fucking thing? Freedom. Burden cage in it, right? Right. Emma gave Jenks the card, right, right, right. Thank you. 
2889. Thank you very much. Look this up. Necklace is Emma's, but she gave it to Kate. Necklace called a freedom necklace. Kate bought loads of, uh, lots of new jewellery. Necklace was an unwanted gift. Huh? Thank you. Oh, right, right, right. Aye. Um, Gibbs HD, thank you very much. Lemmy, you should get a hat like that, Fanny. I would wear a hat, but I don't have one here. Oh, wait. Thank you. Odd boys, thank you very much. Odd boys, thank you very much for the tier one sub. My son's got a hat just like that that he used to dress up, dress up as the janitor for little nightmares that he used for Halloween. I have got a hat like that. Let me go and get it. What's, what's sidestepped? What did I sidestep? I'm Mary. It's okay. It's Thank you. Oh, it's the fan man got gifted. That's a um, rap ga game un -cleaping. Thank you. If you tried reseating the hard drive, that I'm going to do something like that. Thank you very much. So Dave says. This computer problem, mate. Have you checked the fan? Thank you very much. Thanks for that. Right, troops. I'm going to now... Um, see if I can get the... Get this... Uh, get the hat. Right, just, just, just a second. I'm going to try and get this hat. Right, just a second. Thank you. Now we're fucking talking, man. Right, here we go. Now we're talking. Um, get away for the motor, thank you very much mate. Big fan inside the computer, have you tried that? Thank you very much for the banter. Thank you very much. 
Nick was the same as Bishop Kibbe Kibbe. Right, 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 right. Uh, visit Simon. Uh, later on, if that's okay. You should ask about the freedom necklace rather than the pendant. Well, I can do what I fucking want. Thanks. Right. You know what this is? Yeah. Yeah, I think Emma had one like it. Actually, you know what? Kate had one. I remember because I asked Thank her about you. it one night when we were all out drinking. In college. I was probably pretty drunk. That's what college is all about. I missed that. Think, thinks Emma had a similar necklace. Kate wore the necklace at college. Right. That's a contradiction. I, I, I'm, I'm too busy. I'm too busy trying to balance this fucking thing. Buffalo Opal says you look like Jeffrey Boy caught in that. Right. Thank you very much, mate. Um, thinks Emma had a similar necklace. Kate wore the necklace at college. Kate wore the necklace at college. Thank you. Probably be back later. Um. Emma gave you. I know. I know. An unwanted gift. Right. So. So. Right. Do you, do you, do you drag that? What the fuck is that? What's that? I'm dragging that. You just kind of see, but I'm dragging it and it's got the name of a fucking file on my computer. Thank you. Emma said that the broken necklace was an unwanted gift. Uh, that's it for the time being, thank you. Spooky, thank you very much. You're a fantastic person. I truly am your biggest fan. I think I fancy you. Just your reading this makes me want to dance the fandango. You could say I'm a lemmy fanatic. I want to play the fanfare, watching you, thank you. Thank you very much for the fan part. Thank you very much. I think the fan part is new, uh, well and truly deed. I think that's it, deed new. He said he never socialized with her out of thank college. You. You look like one of the one of my characters, the twat in the hat. Velocies, thank you very, very much for saying that. What, what the fuck I missed? I'm too busy. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Replay what I don't know what's going on here. I don't like this hat, it's too. It, this hat's making me hot. I can't think straight. College and socialising, what? I wasn't even listening. I'm too busy fucking reading all, all, all your stuff. Thank you. Gibbs HD, thank you very much. That's not a knife, that's a knife. Thank you very much for the donation. Kate finds death. Um, didn't socialise with Kate outside Atlas. Right. And what? You're a thick bastard, Lemmy. Talis, half the time I'm concentrating on this fucking hat. The other half, I'm reading what you're saying. The other half, I'm reading what you're saying up there with the donations and things like that. The other half, my head's fucking roasting. 
Why is I said fucking Simon? Why is I said Simon? I'm speaking to Simon, that's right, what is it? What is it? What the fuck is it? How many halves? It's a fucking joke! I know there's only two fucking halves. He's, he's fucking stupid. Ah, let me, that's, there's me, you said me and two halves, I fucking know, it's a joke. A third didn't. Didn't socialise. Who is Kate anyway? Oh, right, right, right. Oh, right, I'm getting mixed up with the names, that's all. Kate's the fucking main one. She's Emma. Didn't socialise with Kate outside Atlas. Sam said he saw Kate went, right, 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 right. Of course, of course. There you go then. Right. Um. And then. And then what? When was the last time you saw Kate Vine? Um. So, last Friday. Sorry. Right. Thank you. Then what? Why are you saying Simon? Why the fuck are you saying Simon? Why are you just naming it? Why are you just saying Simon? Cry, 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 Ronald Phillips. Listen, I can't do this, it's fucking roasting. I need to open the window, man, it's fucking... <sighs> fucking hell, man. Right. Right. Right, here we go. Let's get this game fucking completed, man, before I lose every single fucking subscriber. Gibbs HD, thank you very much, mate. Thank you very much. Right. Let me try and concentrate here. Let me try and get this fucking stupid game finished. What was if I did this? Simon has known Kate for three months. Um, no. Right, here we go. Aha. Right. So how did you know Kate was wearing a freedom necklace 18 months ago at college? Well, I, I knew Kate at college, but I, I didn't get to know her till, till we started Atlas. Mm. Right. So you didn't socialise with her at college? No. And you didn't socialise with her outside of Atlas? Uh, no. You didn't see her outside Atlas at all? Um... No. No, no thank you. <laughs> Not at all. So Simon did know Kate at college, but why would he lie about that? Maybe he knows Kate better than he's willing to admit. Six o'clock. I wonder if Rebecca's working in the pub tonight. Okay. Okay. I'm going to investigate behind the pub, actually. With my shoes. Hmm. A broken window. Recently smashed by the look of it. Might have to ask about that. Oh, the tape! Did you see it? That's the same tape that was on the driving license. Um. Hmm. Uh. Well. Alright. 
There's no use for kids. Well, look, there's the fucking tape right fucking there. Where my mate fucking go then? Gibbs HD says, I paid good money for the hat. Get it back on. Bojack Skillman, this game is fucking shit. Get back on the road. Oh, I'll get back on the road later. Right, let me just... This is right, so I'm not allowed, right, so I can't, uh, so it's not permitting me, it's not permitting me to. I, I saw the tape, I saw the tape, it's not permitting me to do anything with that, okay. Absolute blocks. You have to ask about it, mystery chips, I did not fucking ask you, mate. I'm not asking you to play this game for me. Thank you. GP McAdam, get this case solved, Lammy. There's two tons of concrete. Needs delivering to Paris by midnight. Aye, let's get on. Let's get into it. Come on. Let's get into it. Right, let's get in and talk to these fucking idiots. Hmm. Why is it always like this? Look. Thank you. He's always like this, look. Thank you. Graphics are shite, thank you very much for your dish. Monolord, thank you very much for subscribing for the very first time. Welcome to this absolute shite. Press the bell. Can I get you? Rebecca! Jenks. Rebecca, is it? I know you! Mm. There's been an uh, incident in the village. I'm conducting an investigation. You don't know me. A few questions, please. That nah, went by its natural, natural course. Come through. Thank you. Rebecca! I know everything about you, Hen. You don't know What's me. There's been an unexplained death locally. Not sure if you've heard. The student? Yes. Yes, it was dreadful news. You're married to Ryan, one of the Atlas leaders, yes? Look at the camera angles here, man. I am, yes. Well, I just wanted to ask a few questions about Kate and Atlas. If yeah, he's gone out of focus. I don't know if I'll be able to answer any of them, but sure. She's at a 45 degree angle almost. He's like at a 2 degree fucking angle. He's, pr he's almost looking right at the fucking camera. Jenks hasn't asked Rebecca about this yet. Here we fucking go. Right. Did you know Kate? Not very well. She came in a few times, but she was quite a moody person. You could tell she had problems. When was the last she... time you saw her? What was she going to say? Friday. She popped in for a minute. And when was that? Uh, Seven-ish. Was she on her own? I didn't see who she was with. She put £20 on the bar and then left. What was that for? A breakage, presumably. £20? Just for a beer glass? <laughs> well, she was very drunk. She just put it on the bar and then walked out. Was there a broken glass? Not that I noticed. But she was a strange girl. She broke the thingy. Didn't look it very well. Last talk, right, right, right. Didn't look it right, 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 right. License. Have you seen this before? <clears throat> No, sorry. So you didn't know if Kate had lost it? No idea. See when she leans forward, I mean look. Look when she leans forward, look at it look at it going out of focus in the face. Have you seen this before? <clears throat> look at that. No, sorry. So you didn't know if Kate had lost it? No idea. It's quite simple really. Uh, it's up to the d director of photography, the DOP to to ask the director thank you which in Lumbee show would be me 
Any chance we could see you wear that hat on upside down? I'll never ask you to do something like this again, I'm sorry to ask. The DOP will be expecting a director to run through what the action's going to be with the actors. Sometimes you call it blocking. Where's everybody going to be? What's actually going to happen? But in terms of the focus there, in terms of the focus, you'll act it out. And the DOP, the Director of Photography, will look to see where you're moving. In the case of that there, you're going to have to have a focus puller. That is, somebody has got their horns on the focus wheel or focus thing to change the focus from where she was sitting and when she was sitting back to where she was sitting when she sits forward. You'd ask them to rehearse it, you'd ask them to run through it, and you would see if it's just going to be the same. You'd have the focus on, you'd put a wee marker on one, the position of the focus in the first bit, and then at the bit where she moves forward, you'd ask her to just hold that position just for a, bit, a wee bit, and you'd put the, the you'd refocus, and you'd put the wee uh, marker on it, the focus ring, whatever, whatever it is, and then the focus puller who'd be separate for the cameraman stroke DOP would, when the actress there leans forward, turn it to that new the focus ring to the new bit, and then when she sits back, turn it back to where it was before. It's as simple as that. If it's a bit too unpredictable or it's too hard, simply close the aperture a wee bit so you don't have such a shallow depth of field so that whether she leans forward or back the difference if she does got slightly of focus it'll be very very slight it's very very simple it's very very simple it's so so simple it's so fucking simple right here we go Right, here we go. Thank you. Ace Junonia, thank you very much for the sub. I do apologise for this terrible stream. The game is ter terrible. No, it's not. The game, it's the game. This game is good. You have put it into my head that this game is shit. It's a good game. Right, haven't seen the licence before. Doesn't know if Kate had lost the licence. Right, okay. Eh... Uh, do you know anything about a bike at all? Alright. Do you know anything about this screwdriver? Balls. Yeah, what, what do you think of this homebrew you heard about this? Know anything about Simon Thompson's homebrew? Does he make homebrew? Apparently. No, we do buy from a microbrewery, but we don't usually buy from kitchen breweries. Oh. We don't buy for kitchen. <laughs> Breweries, mate, obviously you're new here, but I actually have a very, very high quality restaurant pub here. Maybe you think we're just some sort of daft pub, but when we say pub, we're actually a microbrewery. Um, Segmat, thank you very much. Look here, now I'm the focus puller. Thank you very much, Segmat. Get back to the fan part. Fucking hell, man. Come back. Fan part. Always forgiven. Fucking hell, man. What was that? 
Sigma, look here. Now I'm the focus puller. The fucking hell was that, man? Success? My arse, mate. My arse, that's what you meant. No way. No way. Alright. Alright. Do you recognise this? I've seen students wearing them. It has some sort of meaning, doesn't it? I forget what it is now. Seen anyone wearing one recently? Not that I can remember. Okay. How did the window get broken out round the back? I don't actually know. Um, someone said two girls were arguing outside. I found out after they'd gone. And when was this? Is, is he not without focus on all that? Half past six. I taped over it until I can get it fixed. We don't want people getting cut and suing us. Does that sort of thing happen a lot? Arguments? No, not really. I'm quite strict when it comes to boring clients. I don't think are um, suitable. Oh. <laughs> Like, we don't buy for kitchen breweries and uh, I'm actually pretty strict when it comes to bar and clients who are nowhere, shall we say, suitable. <laughs> Any more questions, officer? You gonna put me in handcuffs? You gonna put me in handcuffs, officer? Oh, what's that down there? Do you want a wee cushion for that? A wee cushion? Right. Do. Look fucking here. I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you right now. The tape. Thank you. Richard Pictures, thank you very much for subscribing. Do apologise for this game. And the part on display here tonight is atrocious. The part on here tonight is absolutely fucking atrocious. Right, um, right, where am I? I don't think there's any contradictions. I don't think there's any contradictions here. I'm going to come out of this just you. now. Probably be back later. Stay on my stupid fucking heart. An absolute joke. An absolute joke. An absolute joke here, man. Um, wait, wait. Absolute joke here, man. Senti Pips. Thank you very much for the sub. Game is a partless void. Aye, it is a bit, you know, there's only, there's only so much I can say about this. She mentioned tape in the window, I know, but what's that got to do with it? She mentioned tape in the window, right? But, um, She mentioned tape in the window, but... I don't know if you can put in... Oh, but look at this. Right, right, let's go back here again, right? Is that is there nothing? Right, broken windy, right? Um, is 
a what right uh, right right I um I don't quite know the game um the game mechanics to what day something about it broke window and 20 pounds but but what I don't want to use the light bulb try using the light I did it before look um look use the light bulb why would I why would I do that? Can I get closer in that? No. Kate broke the window, I probably. But. What can I do? What can I do? She must have known the 20 quid was for the broken window. It doesn't matter, there's nothing I can do. Thank you. I mean, it, it doesn't contradict it. It doesn't contradict it. And I was a little wonder. Thank you very much for gifting a tier one, a tier one sub to some der, some doctor. I mean, um, right, right, right. Hold on in. Right, hold on, hold on in. Right, I'll do this. I'll try it, please. Thank you. Right, you know what I'm going to try and do? How about I try that, right? And... Right. Thank you. Right. Bad clients. Fuck it, do that. That's I know that's pointless. I know that's stupid. That's your nephew. Thank you very much for subscribing. Um, twenty quid. Right. Right. Doesn't know who broke the window. Um, Aha. That doesn't it? It's not contradiction. Yes. Kate gave you twenty pounds for a breakage, but you didn't have a breakage. That's right. Do you think the payment could have been for the broken window? That's not contradiction. Could it have been Kate who was arguing. Well, that isn't it a contradiction. That isn't it a contradiction. That isn't it a contradiction. I think Kate was probably right, yeah. But you don't know who she Thank was arguing you. with. No, I'm not sure. I'll ask around. Isn't it a contradiction? Isn't it a contradiction? In the window. Rebecca really should have worked that out before now. Unless she did. But why would she lie about that? It isn't it a contradiction. That isn't it a contra fucking diction. Gibbs HD, thank you very much for subscribing. Tail one sub, thank you very much, mate. And Gunlag Lugger 01, thank you very much for the uh, Prime sub. Remember, everybody, if you've got um, Amazon Prime, you can subscribe to me for free. Um, what it means is you won't see any ads when I play ads, and it means you get wee emotes, but it's just basically. Um, that sound you basically um, support me but you do it for free because see when you link your Amazon Prime account to Twitch you give me that subscription money it doesn't actually come out your pocket Amazon own Twitch so they, they just give you to give me thank you so you link it up with the wee description there there anyway Gantanel says kill Jenks listen troops um, now that we have established that this game contradiction 
that is like what's that sound? Let's say that, listen. Listen. Gibbs HD, thank you very fucking much for the ge uh, insane generosity. Insane generosity. I'm just about to hit these bastards with a fucking, I don't know. Everybody, Gibbs HD has gifted substate all these fucking people here. Thank you. Gibbs HD, thank you very much for your fucking generosity, mate. Um, while that's happening, everybody. I'm going to go to a, a wee uh, 30 second commercial break and also, uh, for all you non-sub uh, vermin and Thank you. be back in a second. Thank you. Danny Ola, thank you very much mate. Uh, well no thanks because that was, that was gifted, it's all gifted. By Gibbs HD. Thank you. Thank you. Hold on, trips. Just, just the wee second. Thank you. Just the wee second. And finally, there. Oh, you folk there, that was the kind generosity of Gibbs HD. Thank you very fucking much, mate. Thank you very, very much for gifting that. All you people enjoy the emotes that are waiting for you there and you want to get, you want to see any ads. Thank you. Griff the self donated game is contradicting itself, not being about contradictions. You're fucking right, mate. You're right. Thank you. Scott B, thank you very much for the sub, mate. Cheers. My eyes are fucking so. So let's take a fucking moment here, troops. Let's take a moment here. Let's take a moment to address what this fucking means for the game. This game is called. Oh, Verm the Vermin are back. Hello, everybody, come on back. Come on back. Get this game finished, Limbo Slice. I'm going to get it finished as quickly as I fucking can, mate. Get away for the motor. I subscribe, thank you very much, mate. Could have completed the game, but uh, half the game by now. I'm going to, I'm going to battle through it. Don't get why it's not a contradiction, says Spook. It's this simple. Uh, 1326 viewers, hello, everybody. Hello. I just want to say to everybody viewing this this game is called Contradiction. Uh, I think it's actually called Contradiction Spot the Liar. I think that's the full name, but Contradiction. And the actual game mechanics there is you've. Yeah, you did these interviews. And somebody says something in, in, in an interview that contradicts something they said before. It's not something that it gets you suspicious. It contradicts it. That, it that, that's why the game's called Contradiction. It contradicts it. You say one thing and you say another thing that just completely goes against it. Contradicts it. Contradicts. Contra. Kind of, kind of opposite. I think. Dict meaning to speak. Diction. Dictionary. Words. Con contradict. No. That guy before, he said something, he tried to explain away, but the guy before that interviewed said he'd only known that uh, Kate for three months. But he, but he knew her back in college. He knew that she had a necklace. Fair enough, it's no, it's no, a, it's no, a, a contradiction. What he said, I could have spotted her, he knew her, you know, to, to see, to see her. 
and he spotted the necklace, but didn't actually get to know her, right? But it looked like a, it looked like a contradiction. This here, though. Rebecca didn't know who was arguing or who broke the window outside last Friday. Kate gave Rebecca £20 for a breakage last Friday. That doesn't contradict it. Thank you. Could be two separate things. Quite easily two separate fucking things. Just So this is shite. This is shite. That's not a fucking contradiction. So now I have Thank to... You. I have to um, think. I have to think. It, 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 it doesn't fucking contradict... It doesn't contradict it. Spraggy, thank you very much for the for the sub. Thank you very much. Uh, Picky, thank you very much for gifting that sub to Snip. Thank you very much, mate. You are wrong. I'm not fucking wrong. Kate gave Rebecca twenty quid for a breakage. Right. Rebecca didn't know who was argue, who broke the window. Two two separate things. Aye. Come on, man, get on with it at least. You're right. Let's just fucking play this utter shite. Yeah. I'm not gonna sit here all fucking night arguing about it, talking about it. Anonymous, thank you very much for gifting that fucking sub, man. Let's get on with the fucking game. Come on. Let's go on with the fucking stupid game. Eh. Uh, right. Here we go then. Ah, uh, that's all for the moment. Thank you. What really annoys me is that that that, that tape, that cellar tape, that um, polka dot kind of tape that is on a driving license, is um, it's it's there on the fucking thing. Hold on. Ask you a couple more things, please. Um, am I, am I just not getting in? Come on. It's still, it's still not doing it, that's just stupid. Later on, if that's it's just, just a stupid shite game, man. It just doesn't make any sense. It's just so bad. It's just so fucking bad, man. It's just so fucking bad, man. Such a bad, bad game, man. Um. Where, where should I go? Oh, go, go, uh, good day, that. Can't even fucking speak here, man. Always nice to randomly find a key on the floor. Is that right? Fucking dickhead, your game's shit. Your fucking game's fucking crap. Let's go back then. Oh, here, wait a minute. Uh, fucking game shape, man. Go here. Right. Uh, then. Go that way. What do you see, dickhead? Right, there you go, join us here. Isn't that interesting? No, oh, really. Dickhead. Fucking paler than me, man. You're like a fucking ghost. Paler than me. Could spend all your time in your fucking house out of work. Out of fucking work actor, man. Just spending all your days fucking playing games like me, I cunt. I'm surprised you're fucking it up, man. This is absolutely atrocious. Thank you. Uncanny Jack, thank you very, very much for the sub. It's not his fucking fault, I mean, what can he, what can he fucking walk with? What can he walk with? Let's go behind here. That key's gonna open that fucking padlock, man. And then in there, I'm gonna get a close look at the tape. Give me that. Give me it. 
Yes. Yes, man. And you go, dickhead. And you go. Pointy nose. Stupid nose. Stupid hat. Get stay. What are you wearing? What the fuck are you wearing, man? It's like a mess. Stay at this cunt. Oh, cow. I wonder whose mask this is. It's gotta be the worst. Orion's. Worst fucking mask out. Worst cult mask I've ever seen in Eton. Worst cult mask in the fucking history of Eton related to cults. That is the worst. Whoever fucking made that. Whatever fucking art department made that mask. What, that a fucking Wayne made that. A paper mashy. A Wayne in fucking primary school could make a mere convincing fucking uh, cult mask in that. Absolute fucking terrible. Absolute shit. Just looks like junk, but it's too dark to tell. And switch on the fucking light then and move the fucking ladders then. And fucking move it. Move the stuff what I've got to go looking for a fucking light now, have I? Is there nothing here? Um uh, a strange cardboard mask was found in a box marked uh, Atlas, right, gonna ask about that then, will I? It's like fucking shit. Um, right, well, so I can't, I can't go back there because it's too dark. It's slightly dark. It's slightly, slightly, slightly fucking dark. Uh, so that's it. Go to leave. Okay, here we go. Speaks in binary. Thank you very much for the sub. Here we go. Let's ask her while I'm here. Just a few more questions, if you don't mind. Do you know what this is? Oh, you'll have to ask Ryan about that. So this is Ryan's. I didn't it's say that. With one of Ryan's methods on the course. Go on. Go on. Well, hmm? masks allow you to play at being someone different for a while. Students find it quite liberating. So this would be for a student? I think that one's Ryan's, but students do wear them, yes. Do you and Ryan wear it? She just asked Ryan about the mask, mask, that looks coarse, mask, I think the mask is Ryan's. So do you and, you and, you, you and uh, Ryan... Uh, So do you and Ryan there uh, wear this, uh, you know, I have to, I have to say, um, I hope you don't mind me saying this, and I mean this in a professional manner, very, very attractive. Okay, that's it for now. Thank you. you. Very, I, I mean this, 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 I mean this in a strictly professional manner, but you're quite an, quite an attractive, attractive lady. Hmm. I mean this in a... Strictly professional manner, that you're quite an attractive, attractive lady. <sighs> if you don't mind me, quite an attractive lady. If you don't mind me saying so, hmm. yes. But where is this prick, Ryan? Where is he? Where is he? Let's get it here. I hope you don't mind me saying, but uh What do you think of my shoes? Right, not now. Where you go? Your fucking shoes are a joke. A joke. Call the chief. Chief! I've cracked it. Chief, I've cracked it. I'm calling the chief. Thanks. 
thank you. Thank you very much for gifting that fucking sub there. And I was a little wonder, thank you very much. Right, so that's not happening. Chief. I found a mask. Mask. Right, so where is this country? Baker? Ryan, right. Oh, that's right, 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 right. Um, right, right. I go, go up here, speak to some people. Um, what was that way? Or oh, there. In fact, go back. In fact, you know what I do? Just do this. Go back here. Uh, go in here. Emma! About a few more things, please. Emma. Put the mask on. It's me, it's me, it's me. So, are you, is this all sort of like, you sort of have an old Jason? Ever seen this before? This before? Hmm? Mm, nope, but I haven't, sorry. I think I'd have remembered it. <laughs> what are you... What are you ladies up to in this village? With these, these men? What are you ladies up to in this village with these men? Hmm. Yes, we'll have to get to the bottom of this. Wouldn't we? find out. This is certainly an interesting, an interesting job, this one. This is what you, what you ladies are up to here, with these naughty, naughty men. Hmm. I won't arrest you if you just let me know, let me in on what's going on here. I just want to take part to find out and then I'll know everything's above board. Thank you. Scottish Tribal, thank you very much for the sub, mate. Cheers. I haven't seen a mask before. Thank you. Probably be back later. Same in you, that's it, that's it. That's it, that's it, that's it, boy. Have a look at this. See this? You dirty fucking bastard. I haven't seen this one, but it looks a lot like an Atlas mask. Are you asking? Some of the um, some of the workshops and stuff. Really? You dirty bastard. But you um, you have to say something uh, boastful or uh, or arrogant. Mm -hmm. You do it first without the mask, and then you say it with a mask. And like pointers? Well, it's easier when you have the mask on, isn't it? People are not as afraid to be free about themselves, you know. What did you find out about? And this um, actually. I think I've still got the... Do, um, well, first, can I ask you, do you ever do anything... This is the advert okay. that was at my college. Uh, to be honest, I've learned more in three months at Atlas than I did in three years at business school. <laughs> can I keep that? Yeah, go for it. Can I keep that? Hmm. I suppose that might be useful as a conversational starter. So what are these things, I'm not surely to... to... to break down the barriers, there will be some form of, perhaps... Stripping off, is that right? Some form of stripping off of, of, of the personality, yes. Perhaps even literal, literal stripping off. Perhaps there would be some stripping off of the the uh, the, the, the clothing. But would, would that and 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 when? And would I be able to to see that? That's all. Pob, thank you very much. Two pound donation, an extra eight pen, pen step. This game is so bad it's funny. Look forward to the next walk in the park. Walk in the park tomorrow, everybody. Tomorrow morning, nine o'clock. Morning motivator. I will be here. In the 
in the house till morgon mon- 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 Then I'm going to go for a walk. And I will be streaming me. Uh, I'm glad you liked it, Thatcher said. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go somewhere and, and we'll have a wee laugh, right? I'm going to take the phone, obviously, to somewhere and, and have a wee laugh. Oh, a few people saying wank in the park. <laughs> I mean, just look at yourselves. Look, Cron is like a wank, wank in the park. Chancellor Dancer, wank in the park. Indiana Jason, having a wank in the park. That should surely be a fucking wake up call there, seeing your partner. You think it's just you that's got the partner. Two other fucking cunts, even one other cunt, two other cunts have the exact, fucking exact same partner, man. That should be your fucking wake up call right there. That should be your wake up call right there, man. Right. Here we go then. Um, know anything about an argument at the pub last Friday? No, sir. No, oh, I didn't go to the pub last Friday. He's got snorts on him. Do you go to the courts? Just went home. Came here. Just came straight back. Oh. Came straight back. Went straight home after Atlas last Friday. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Thank you. Probably be back later. Did you hear about an argument in the pub last Thank Friday? You. No, I wasn't there. You weren't in the village? No, I went home last last Thursday night, actually, to see my parents. But you do visit the pub. Oh, but yeah, Thank I mean, I, I know Rebecca quite well. We, we all went there quite a bit after college. Hmm. 42 Bunsy, thank you very much for the sub. Rachel... Rach... I don't know if that's Rach, Eel Clay, or Rachel Clay, Clay. I've, I do apologise if I've got, got it wrong, but thank you very much for the sub and welcome to the stream, both of you. Right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Went home to see parents on Thursday night. Um, knows Rebecca quite well, went to pub after college. Right. Um, does that... This is fucking terrible. Well, you know what I want used to day trips? Uh, Northrath, uh, BC2, thank you very much for resubscribing for the second month. Thank you very much. I want you to help me. I want you to help me. Because I'm getting bad feedback for you about this game. And I don't want to play a game that you don't like. So, let's just get on with it. Right? Now, I'm not asking you to go online and look at a fucking walkthrough. I'm not interested in that. Don't tell me where to go next and all that shit. I want it. In fact, don't bother telling me. I'll just, just have a... Um, you know, like, there's something to do with Thursday. Went home to see parents Thursday. Um... Look at that. What do you know about Atlas? I know that it's um, it's a business course. I went with Simon when he first went, but it wasn't really my thing. How often did you go? Just the once. And you decided it wasn't for you? Yeah, I'd been to something similar, so I decided it wasn't for me. I don't know what saying, Trips. What do you know about Atlas? I know that it's um, it's a business course. Right, so she 
spot any contradictions there, man. Uh, know anything about a broken window at the pub around the back? Around the pub? Um, a broken window at the back? Hmm? Yeah, I saw it was broken. When was that? I was in the pub on Monday with a college friend. But you said, but wait a minute, wait a bloody minute, I thought, I thought you said, wait a minute, but didn't you say, I wonder if you stayed at your par parents' house, does that contradict that? Does that contradict that? Or does it not? Does it? It doesn't. Does it? Does this? It doesn't contradict it. Let's see if it in red pops up. What's the stack of bottles outside? Oh, that's all Simon's stuff. You better ask him. I, I don't know. Hey, you're a fucking liar. I'll tell you what, you're a fucking liar. Monday's after Thursday. I know, but she could have been away all that time, alright? And I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what, sweetheart, so yeah, you're a fucking liar. And we're gonna get to the truth here. And if I find out that you've been telling me anything short of the, the, the fucking God's honest truth. If I find out you be telling me anything less than fucking gospel, I'm gonna go through you like a dose of the fucking salts. That's all for the moment, thank you. De, de, de. Let's just go through it like that. Look, shh, shh. let's just go through them. Robotic, robotic man. Do you know anything about a broken window at the pub? At so the I pub. Don't really go to the pub very often. I'm not exactly a pub person. And how was that? You're saying as if I should have known that. Are you taking a piss out me? Are you trying to say I should know these things? You haven't told me. You haven't told me. I don't like your fucking attitude, son. Right, I don't know if it, I don't know if there's any contradictions there, troops, but I've done the worst end. Thank you. Midge six ninety. Thank you very much for the sub, mate. We're gonna get this game finished as quickly as we possibly can. Um. Not a pub person, but she said they went loads after college. Um, not a pub person, but makes beer. That's no contradiction. You could be into drinking. Oh, I'll try it. Fuck it. Look. Watch this. See, in this game, this could be a fucking contradiction. Um, what was that? Right. Good, good. 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 Goes to the pub all the time, but it doesn't say that he's went to the pub. Let's just go, mate. Come on. Ask him if he knows who killed Kate. Did you kill Kate? Joseph Mumford, thank you very much. Don't listen to the naysayers. I'm loving this big fan of the soul. 
So bad they're good story games. I like it, I know. Aye, I, I mix up, you're right, mate. Be back later on, if that's okay. Let's find out what happened. Right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to travel a bit this way. Let's go all the way here. All the way here. Ensa. Yes, I'm in, man. I'm in. Fucking shoes, man. Hello. Ryan was interviewed in the lounge, according to the report. That must be his office. Um. When doing a voiceover for a game, use one of these. It's called a pop shield or a pop filter. I'm just going to quickly go to the hallway. I'm going to come back. He's not saying it this time. But he said something like, let's say Peter. 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 It sounds the same, or does it? It's, it sounds the same. Oh, are both of them. Were both of them popping the thingy? I think he's a talking shite. Oh, he's got liars. He's a liars. Oh, no answer. Strange. Very strange. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Leave the room. Yes, good idea. Good stuff. Thank you. Lauren and Stallman, thank you very much for the tier 1 sub. Thanks for resubscribing for your second month. Oh look, nice wee background here. Try the door on the right, try that. Nothing works. Lemuel Mike isn't good enough for the pop show to be effective. Your rank fuse gate. Your rank. Hey, come on, I, energy, come on, come on. Let's go through it one bit. Uh, I have to go to clearing. Do you see anything? Nope. Take a left. Go here, go to the J. Do you see anything? Look, I mean, look. They're there. Nothing here. Go left. There. Oh, fucking dear. Who is it? I'm a police officer, Detective Inspector Jenks. It's all right, you can carry on if you want to. I'm just going. Oh dear. I'm investigating a, a death in the village, Kate Vine. There was a death recently. Oh dear. I knew her. Well, could I ask you a few questions, please? A bit dark. Well, if you give me your name and address, I'll come later on. Where do you live? Turn around. And what's your name? I'm going to pin this in you, son. Oh, fuck. Sorry. Oh, my God. You missed all that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Um...
I'm so sorry. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um, it, it was a, it was a guy, it was a guy with a bong. It was a guy with a bong. Reenact it, right? The guy, the guy was like that. Look, there was a guy like that. Look, and dickhead comes along, jinks, and the guy's like, and he goes, "No, don't worry, I'm just asking a few questions." A bong, a fucking thing like that with a thing at the top to put something on it and go. <laughs> that thing. He looked like. Um, just look, he looked a wee bit fat, dark hair, bald and slightly, uh, moustache maybe, beard. He looked more like an alky than a stoner. <sighs> right. She's at the farmhouse. Nothing here. Straight ahead. The pub. So, uh, let's go back in here. Oh, fuck, I'm doing it again! Sorry, 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 sorry. Learned nothing, I know, sorry, sorry. Yeah, let's speak Hello, to her again, man. If that's okay? Hi, me again. You must be sick of. sick of seeing me. How do you do it? What do you. What are you doing after this? Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, freedom necklace. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right, here we go. What do you know about this? It's an advertisement. They had it designed by an agency, I think. And when was that? Last year sometime. Hmm. Okay. 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 And what? Thank you. Probably be back later. Probably be like back later. It's okay to drop in you about nine and ten or night at night. Yes. Okay. If I was to drop in, then who, who, who would be home at that time? I want to thank you for all your help. Can I bring you over a bottle of what bottle of wine? Perhaps we can drink it in a restaurant. Tell me more about this. These orgies that they have. Right. Still nothing in here. Right, get out of there. Get out. Get out. I, I still don't know. Um, no, no, no. Down there. No, 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 no. Straight ahead. Keep going. Nope. According to the map, Abbey Farm is across the road there. Alright, let's go then. I've unlocked a place. Ring the doorbell. Got the steps first, man. These shoes. These fucking shoes. Investigate. Oh. Picture frames with black painted glass. Very interesting. Hmm. Very interesting. Hmm. Let's see. Picture frames with a glass painted black. We're seeing. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Hmm. Very interesting. Um, let's go back down and speak with. Speak with uh, this cunt. Please ring the bell. There he is. Ask you a few more questions, please. It'd take you long. Haven't got much time. Just oh, do you see that? Oh, ah, <laughs> that comedy. <laughs> that comedy, man. Sit. Oh, anywhere's fine. I uh, didn't quite catch your name. James, sit there. Thank you, James. Is that Scarface, but looking like uh, Frankenstein? Why are you asking me? Frankenstein's okay. a monster. Dean. You know Simon, don't you? Thompson. Why, what did he say? That you all went to college together, you and Kate. That right? Might have done. Right. He looks a bit like, uh, Good enough. Milo. Remember Milo? The Scottish, uh, dance music guy. By the way, I don't mean to remember him. I mean, because I was asking a few years ago, um, what happened to him? And he's still kicking about. You fucking dare know him. You fucking dare, man. You dare know him, man. M Y L O. Right, here we go. Let's let's do everything here, man. Let's do everything here. When was the last time you saw Kate Vine? Can't remember. How did you know her? Uh, through Simon. His girlfriend was mates with her. Saw her around college a few times. Did you socialise with her much? Nah. She wasn't my type. Yeah, no. It reminds me of, what's his name for uh, the good gentleman in side number nine, or that. Did you know whether Kate had lost this or not? <laughs> No idea. No idea. No idea. What do you know about Simon's bike? No idea, mate. You haven't seen him on a bike? What's the bike? I've seen him. When was the last time you saw him? About a month ago. What? Is, what's, what's the bike? What's the bike? I don't know. Have you uh, ever tried Simon's homebrew? I've tried acid. Thompson's tar? Yeah, I've tried it. Did he sell it? Well, not to me, not for money anyway. We used to trade stuff. What did you trade? I make a nice home. Gobbles. Him and his girlfriend were into it. What was his beer like? Lethal. Strong. <laughs> Knock your eyes out. He's the best guy in this. He's the best actor in this. He's the best actor in this. He's the best actor in this, I'd say. You know, everybody's listening, everybody's knocking, everybody's acting now. Necklace. Everybody's acting their heart out. Ever seen one of these before? Freedom necklace. I don't think so. Again, why is it? Where's it looking? Where's it looking? Know anything about a broken window? Go to the pub. You go to the pub. The pub. Didn't say that. I say that. Been to the pub, but the pub. not about two months, three months. It sounds like Les Dennis. It sounds like Les Dennis. Don't it? Well, let me let me hear that again. Didn't know anything about broken window. Hasn't been a pub for over two months. Know anything about Les Dennis? Went to the pub last Friday. No. Oh wait. Ever seen this before? No, should I have? No, it's okay. Should I have? No. I don't know. 
Where's it looking? Is it meant to be looking at a fire or? Ever seen one of these? Seen them around college. What do you know about it? Less than us. Much. It's a business course. Ask Simon. He's on it. You wouldn't be interested in that sort of thing. <sighs> and you haven't discussed it with And our survey said. Really? Business doesn't interest me. Business doesn't interest me. We asked 100 people. We, we asked 100 people. Name something associated with. Snow White and the Seven Dwarves. Um, Snow White. Ding! It's the top answer. Um, do you want to play a pass? Uh, we'll play. We asked a hundred people, name something associated with us fucking the, the game contradiction. But do woo 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 woo. Um, there's the shy acting. Ding! It's number three. Sally? Um. Th there's no. There, 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 there aren't. There's bits that aren't, that, that aren't the contradictions. Let's see if it's there. It's a top answer. Do you want to play or pass? We're going to play. Okay. John, John, John. So, John, you're the daddy of this family. So, what is it you both kids then? I see. Oh, I keep you on your toes then. I'll play the day. So, we asked 100 people. Name something associated with this fucking game. What do you think? Um, the bad focus pulling, bad focus pulling. Let's see. <coughs> uh, I would have said that myself. I would have said that myself. If it's up there, I'll give you the money myself. I kind of deal with Dennis. If it's up there, I'll give you the money myself. Now, what's all this stuff in the workshop? Paint and stencils and things like that. Fuck, fuck it, what to do with you? Oh, fuck what to do with you, pig. Me. They're black mirrors. Scrying mirrors. Black mirror? Now, what's a scrying mirror? Show you one if you want. Hmm. The scrying mirror. Show us your house. The ancient Persians did it. Thank you. This country pagans still practice it. The fortune tellers pretend to do it, that's what the crystal ball's all about. It's all scrying. The mirror's just one way of doing it. We asked a hundred people. What is scrying? Depends Something to do with scrying. People do it for different reasons. Different reasons, you know. Exploring your mind. Clearing your mind. Communicating with the dead. Is that what you use them for, James? Communicating with the dead. Do you think that's fucking funny? And they make them for other people these days. And there's a market for these, is there? Lots of people want to talk to the death star. Or get the star. Don't believe in it. Thanks for the supper. I don't do it for the money. I'm very charitable. For money. Can I keep this? Keep it. Keep it. Thank you. Black mirrors and hookah pipes. I wonder what else James is into. Oh, wouldn't you love to fucking know you dirty bastard, man? Wouldn't you love to fucking know you dirty yeah. bastard? Do I do? Thank you very, very much for the sub. Welcome to this fucking shit. Amazing shit game. That, I, that was a really good explanation. And... Um, that's that. Um, I can't see any. I can't see any contradictions. I've not been able to see any contradictions for quite a while now. I'm just going to come out there. Time being, thank you. 
You've got really nice teeth. Thank you very much. Speedrun. Get it sped ran. Anything up here? Thank you. Smash Bones, thank you very much for resubscribing for two months. Welcome to this game. I do apologise. I do apologise. Right, let's go up here, man. Are they in yet? Nebby's in. Um, let's just quite simply go to them. I like that the game has a 30 second background loop. I can stick the music off if you want. Thank you. RPWH underscore, thank you very much for the, the sub, thanks for subscribing for the first time. Just gonna knock the window, uh, the window from, Questions, please. from that Emma. Have you seen one of Over the there he is before. Is that from James? Now what do you know about James? Hmm. That is creepy. <laughs> He was selling them last Friday at the market. There's, there's a market every week type thing. And uh, I usually go there for lunch. So you wouldn't buy one of these? No, I wouldn't. But Kate would. Was she uh, into this sort of thing? <laughs> no, I, I, I don't think so. She bought one and uh, I went round to her flat to try it out. You're meant to see ghosts or spirits or something. It doesn't work. How do you use it? You just meant to stare into it. Shall I show you? Go ahead. Okay, so you just you just stare stare like this. Mm-hmm. And okay. uh Okay. Then you see See what? <gasps> Sorry, um uh, look, uh, ugh, you just, you're meant to see a ghost or something. Look, it doesn't work. Didn't see what? What did you see? See what? You tell me what you saw, I will send you to prison for the rest of your life. What did you see? What did you see? Thank you. Ryan1473, thank you very much for the sub. Friday, let me contradiction. What's this? See, I'm too busy focused on you, man. And Paul, no, no. I get lost, no. James was selling them last Friday. Ah! You said, wait a minute, wait a minute, you said, ah. So, you went home to see your parents on Thursday night, Hi. that right? Uh, yes. But you said you saw James at the market. Ah. Um, no, I went to ah. um, see my parents on Friday night. No. What time did you go on Friday? Um, Eight or nine. Yeah. Did you see Kate at all on Friday? No. You look like you're green. You're not a very good liar, Emma. You look like you're green. <laughs> I saw Kate. Where? At the pub we were arguing. Go on. What were you arguing about? I, I'd lent her 50 pounds because she was desperate and we were just arguing. I, I, it didn't really bother me. She just didn't have it. Ah. <laughs> Yes. Ah. She, she did things like that, but she was. Ah. Yes. You have caught lying. So it was Emma arguing with Kate. But why didn't she want to admit it? In case it gave her a motive or something else. 
Hmm, yes. Hmm. Yes, um... Is that it? Thank you. Probably be back later. Aye. She's getting banged up. Banged up. Ever seen... When off at these? Yeah, that's one of James's. He's into like new age stuff, mysticism, magic spells, that sort of thing. He's nuts, though. I mean, he thinks the government are tracking him. Or something. <laughs> Why would he think that? Well, I don't know. You'd have to ask him. <laughs> Thank you. Why do you think that? <laughs> Rob Hall. Thank you very much for the sub, mate. Right, uh, I think that's that, I think that's that. So, um, I think, any contradictions pop up? Ah, uh, that's all for the moment, thank you. Any contradictions, um, perhaps go to the pub? Me again? Hi there. Hi, me again. I'll ask you a couple more things, please. What do you think of this scurrying mirror stuff, Rebecca? Can I call you Becky? What do you make of all this uh, scurrying mirror stuff? Do you ever look in the mirror? You must look in the mirror when you're... When you're the... You're, yeah, you're doing your, you're, you're doing your makeup because it's great makeup. Thank you, Scotty. Please, thank you very much for the tier one sub. Because your, your, your makeup is. Uh, thank you. It's, it's beautiful. McAlpine ninety seven. Thank you very much for the sub, mate. Thank you. Frame eighty nine. Thank you very much for the subscription. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. So, Rebecca, about. What do you know about mirrors? Have you seen one of these before? Is it meant to be black like that? I think so. Mm hmm. No. Do you, do you like do you like mirrors? Do you Be like, back later on if that's okay. I can tell you're someone who looks in a mirror a lot, not in a vain way. Just you're very, very well, you're very well turned out. You have a you have a natural a natural. Uh, Natural beauty. Very well turned out. I think you're absolutely delightful. I've got to, I've got to put together a compilation. A Columbo sent a women, especially young women, especially wee lassies. In fact, only wee lassies. You know, you're actually a remarkably pretty wee girl. Thank you. Imaginist, thank you very much for the sub. Columbo, I've, se I've seen him say it about three times. Let me see. Columbo, um, there's the one the sky high IQ, I can't remember the name. It's the one with the, the high IQ lot, and there's a lass in there, and I think he says to her, "You know, 
you're actually a remarkably pretty, pretty young girl. Like that, and she's like, oh, thank you. He says it to another lassie in an office, I think. Something like, you know, you're actually, uh, you know, you're actually quite attractive, very attractive. Oh, thank you. And I also says it to a wee lassie, like a wee wee lassie, when he's outside. Um, he goes like, you're beautiful, you, ain't you? And you know it, don't you? And you know it. So, um, so you might keep your eye on that one. Right, keep your eye on that one. Fuck. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry. Fat heat, sorry. Come on, get this game fucked. Try to die. Get this game fucking completed, come on. Yeah, leave. This game is just cutscenes. Oh, it's a video game, Samurai. It's a video game. It's a video. A video game. <sighs> not here, not here. Take a left. Take a left again and have another wee look, just in case, just in case, just in case. What's that? Fuck all. Um, let's go that way. Back. Left. Yeah, I can't remember what this one is. Oh, that's... Um, Oh, I've done that, I've done that. Uh, anybody, what, what, what did I do now? Nothing there. I can't quite remember what I have to do. Um, next. Wait, what, was the, what was the last thing I, I did there again? Why? Try using it. Try using the fucking thing. Go back to James. Alright. That kid. Did I show Simon in the middle? Aye, aye. I think. Fuck this game, Lenny. Get, get in the truck. Uh, what time is it? Quarter to twelve. Um, A few more questions, if you don't mind. <sighs> Troops. I'm a bit tired. Let me let me just play this and eight. Let me just play this and eight. Right. Let me just play this and eight. Right. I don't know if I could I could take staying up to like half twelve. One. And then, and then going into lorry driving. Right, let me play this. Right. What? There's nothing there. Um. What's the, what's the, what is the, any contradictions here? Try murder at lake, oh. Okay, that's it for now, thank you. Oh, let's see, let's see, interesting, interesting.
apology accepted. Must be Stoner guy said he hasn't seen Kate but sold her a mirror. Are you sure about that? Uh, just go through every fucking answer bit by bit and get it but uh, don't know what could be fucked contradiction Emma said she lent Kate money but that she wasted money on jewellery what right I right, let's Hello, Jenks? Yeah, Chief, I had a confession from Emma hmm? Bowman. It turns out she was arguing with Kate last Friday outside the pub. Kate broke the window. That's what the money was for. Uh-huh. What were they arguing about? Money. Uh. Emma says she'd lent some to Kate, but Kate hadn't paid it back. So Kate had money problems, so she broke a window and then paid Rebecca back for it. <laughs> Something doesn't add up there, Jax. It doesn't make sense, does it? No. Call me back when you know some more. Okay. Speak later, Chief. Uh, bye. Hmm. <laughs> obviously they couldn't, uh, obviously they couldn't afford or thought they'd uh, cut back the the old budget there. Cut back the old budget. Let me go back in here. A uh, few more questions, if you don't mind. Hey, wait a minute. Look. Thanks, James. Good to be with you. Um. No. Thank you. Probably be back later. Do you think I should get the chief as the game's hint system? Is it? Oh fuck! Just, just let's just. If that's okay. Um. Uh, oh. Emma, money and jewellery sounds right. Kate bought lots of new jewellery. Ah, uh -huh. oh, there you go. 
So you lent money to Kate because she was desperate, but she bought loads of jewellery and things. So why were you lending her money? Well, no, it's because, um... It was... It's... It wasn't about money. Was it, Emma? No. Go on. What was it really about? We were arguing because she was going to blackmail Ryan, the guy from Atlas, over an affair he was having, and then tell his wife if he didn't give her the money. Ryan's affair with Kate? No, I don't know. I think he was having an affair with another student and Kate found out. And why were you involved? Because I didn't really agree with it. I didn't agree with what she was doing, even if <sighs> with her. Were you friends with Ryan? No, I'd never met him. You just thought Kate was wrong? Hmm, not sure about this. Emma's either on a moral crusade, or there's another reason she was worried about Kate blackmailing Ryan. Right, listen, troops. I'm fucking energy and old time. <laughs> listen, troops. I'm fucking knackered, man. Right? I'm fucking knackered. This game here. This game here. Now, I will play it another time, but I'm fucking calling it a day with this fucking... This is fucking wank, says Lemmy. I'm calling it a day with this fucking game, man. Right? I'm calling it a day with this fucking game. Now, I can stay up knackered to 1 in the morning, 2 in the morning, playing fucking Euro Truck Simulator, and I'll be knackered, or I can come back and hit the fucking ground and running with high-speed energy. The more. Or just... Get this to fuck. Just get it to fuck. Before I leave though, do you ever want to see this game again? Or like, do you never want to see it again again? Or do you want to see it again but just just not tonight? Not tonight. Looks mixed. It looks mixed to me. Right, troops. Um, I'm gonna leave the game for now. I am tired. You know what? I actually think I'm getting a cold. I actually think I'm getting a cold. Um, so I'll play it another time, right? But I'm absolutely knackered, man. I'm absolutely knackered. Then. Uh, so that's that. And there's no way I want my new subscribers and new followers and people who are watching this to think this is what it's always like. Me like this. This just happens to be a low energy stream the night. Um, so ladies and gents, what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the game here. And I'll get out before, it's not even midnight. I'm going to end the, the stream here before midnight. And, um, see bruh, thank you very, very much for the last minutes up there. I will be back on here at 9 o'clock tomorrow morning, Glasgow time. For the Monday morning. The, the morning motivator where I'll be just yapping away for a quarter an hour, half an hour. And then I'm going to go for a walk to the park and then I'm going to take the phone out my pocket in the park and I'm going to stream a wee bit there. Alright. So I will see you fresh as a daisy the morning morning, nine o'clock, right? Don't miss it. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching this game. Um, I'm going to keep it at another time because I think we can have a good laugh at it. Maybe there's lack of energy and too much of that fine part. 
So folks, thank you very much uh, for watching. Thanks for all the subs. Thanks for all the donations, the bits. Thanks for following and thanks for watching. And I will see you tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock, hopefully. I mean, hopefully you come. I'll definitely be here. Until then, we'll see you later.